In today's video, I'm going to show you how to speed up the exporting process in DaVinci Resolve, not only to save you time and also to streamline things during the editing process. So let's jump right into it. Now, before we start editing or exporting anything, we want to make a few tweaks to resolve that will massively speed up things later on down the line. All right, first let's jump on my computer and let's open up my resolve window with a random test clip. So first of all, we want to make sure that DaVinci Resolve takes advantage of your computer's GPU to speed up the exporting process. In order to do this, you wanna to go to preferences, memory and GPU. And then you wanna make sure that the box is unticked next to where it says GPU processing mode. And instead of leaving it at auto, you wanna set it to OpenCL, which is a lot faster. Next, we wanna optimize the project settings. So in order to do that, you wanna click on the little cog symbol on the very bottom right corner and select master settings. There is a section which is called optimized media and render cache. So DaVinci Resolve is giving you the option what kind of codec you want to use. So depending on the speed of your computer, you could either go for ProRes 422 for both options. For example, if you are shooting stuff like 10 bit footage or alternatively the ProRes LT is a pretty decent codec for 8 bit footage from my experience. So I tend to use ProRes or H.264 depending if I'm rendering for a client or only my own social media. Okay, in the last step, we want to generate optimized media with those settings. So you wanna select all of your clips in the media pool, then right click on them and then click generate optimized media. So basically what happens during the editing process, DaVinci Resolve will save pre-rendered versions of your clips, which then can be used during the entire export process. So your computer is kind of doing the work already while you are editing, and that will save you a lot of time during the export process. Once you're done editing your video, it is time to click on that little rocket icon, AKA the deliver tab. Now on the top left, there are a bunch of inbuilt presets for social media platforms and so on. I tend to select custom and leave most things unchanged most of the time. However, you wanna scroll down to where it says use optimized media and use render cached images and toggle the boxes next to those settings. And that is it. Give it a try and let me know in the comments below if this helped to improve your exporting speed. Don't forget to hit the like button so this doesn't get lost on YouTube. And if you want to, you can subscribe for more videos like this. And I will see you guys in the next one.